was transfixed. Moya kept talking while I watched this man, this old, grizzled man, lift a bus with his mind. I'm strong, but nowhere near that powerful. Alden was born to the leader of the First Sons. As a powerful mentalist, he was groomed from an early age to assume control. That is, until Kessler showed up. Alden disappeared into the streets, growing up scared and homeless. But there's no fear in those eyes now. No, the blast has made him powerful. It gave him the tools to combat his paranoia. With a flick of his wrist, he threw the bus on top of the hospital, sending a message to anyone that would challenge him. Trish still inside that thing, I had to act fast. Not that I could do anything to Alden. He was already gone. By the time I got inside, it was too late. The place was slick with gore. Poor bastards never got any backup. If Zeke kept his post, they'd be alive now. And Alden would still be in a cage. Not sure Zeke's ever gonna forgive himself for this. Don't know that he should. Screams from Tenth City. They were drunk on power, proud of their victory over the cops and over me. Now the race here seems farther away than ever. All they knows we're coming. They'll prepare. 